Pisces, how are you? So, I wanted to get on here and I wanted to share a few things with you, a couple um, intuitive energies or just hunches that I've been feeling. So, if you are Pisces and you have been feeling more out of sync than usual, that you know, you're just, um, could be feeling a little off balance, um, you know, in the last week or two or whatnot, um, and just having a difficult time um, with some thoughts or things coming up. A, we're in Gemini season, um, you know, which is a mind or whatnot. But these doubts, if you're having more resentment, that's, that's where I'm getting. If you're having, if you're feeling more resentment lately towards um, your partner or your soulmate or someone that you're not with that did something to you and, you know, you, you guys have been going through the cycle and, you know, you've had some faith. But if, if lately you've been feeling more resentment than normal, like just, just this anger coming up and bubbling up because it's taking so long, um, just know that you are feeling that because your soulmate is getting closer um, to coming towards you, okay? Um, and so in this read, exactly what I decided to do is, what is out of Pisces awareness, okay? What is out of Pisces awareness? And so the first couple cards that popped up are the Knights of Pentacles, so an offer of a more you know, efficient hard work and responsibility um, and, and, and victory, okay? Um, a victory, a success, okay? So there will be success in regards to this love um, that's right now is turned upside down, okay? And in which you're trying to make purpose and sense out of all of this, okay? Um, another big thing that I'm getting is Pisces, how you work on yourself during this time, okay? Now, of course, everything is perspective and how we choose to look at things, but how you work on yourself and show up for yourself during this time and, and work on your mind and, and work on your compassion, okay? That is why compassion is, is, is such a strong word here and as we're working on ourselves, Eight of Pentacles, um, because this person is, is coming closer to, to coming forward and, 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 and Pisces, you're close to getting what you want. Um, but if you do not maintain the right perspective, um, when it comes to you, you will deny it. You will, you will push it away. Okay, now, um, you know, if, 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 if you close your heart off. Now, Many Pisces, there's different situations. Some situations there is no coming back from. You know, if, if, if you're in a violent relationship, you know, then I don't suggest, you know, working anything out or, you know, that's on you. But how you show up for yourself during this time, okay, that you're feeling even more uh, this res resentment. And, and this resentment is coming up because, you know, obviously it's coming up for your partner. They're thinking, okay, you know, what I've done in the past, how can I possibly come forward and get this victory? I mean, they're maneuvering and that energy tugs on you. But them coming closer makes all these doubts and insecurities, you know, sh show up more for you. Um, it, 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 it's kind of like the energy, the tug and pull. Now that they've come closer, now you're thinking all these doubts. Okay, but now I don't want them, everything that they've done to me and, and all that. So... You need to rise above that, Pisces. I'm not saying, you know, to just completely accept this person when they come back or, or, or whatever the situation. What is out of your awareness, though, is that there is, someone is coming back, okay? Um, you know, whether you f feel it or not, um, you know, whether you, think of, whether you think about it. I know, you know, Pisces, a lot of you have... Um, have kind of lost hope. I mean, you know, Pisces right now is, is in a moment of introspection, um, you know, kind of isolation and taking a, a deep look. Um, but again, the major messages is how you show up for yourself during this time will, will really determine how this outcome happens, okay? How this, how this outcome happens. If, if you can't show up for yourself, if you can't work past your feelings of resentment, which you're coming forward for a reason in Pisces, you know, one of the lessons here is forgiveness, 
you know, and, and, and as a Pisces myself, I almost cringe as I said that because I know my higher self, I know what I need to do. And sometimes we don't want to do it because it doesn't feel good. I, you know, we don't want to forgive after someone has done A, B, C, D, E, F, G, like down through Z, you know, you gave them plenty of chances, but Pisces, in a way, this person didn't know what they were doing. It's almost like they were asleep. Again, I'm not speaking to every single Pisces, okay? I'm sleep. I, I, I'm. I was gonna say I'm sleeping now. I'm speaking to a specific, um, you know, set of Pisces that are dealing with a situation like this, and I believe that the certain Pisces that I'm speaking to vibrate on a on a higher level, um, because it's really what it's calling here, and, and the intuitive hunches that we, you know, we've had is to maintain an open heart. So let's clarify this Knight of Pentacles and this Six of Wands. I hope that little spiel just made some sort of a. Again, shadow side. Yes, as this offer is coming closer, the more these shadow thoughts are, are showing up for Pisces, okay? Knight of Pentacles and Six of Wands. Please clarify, Spirit Angels and Guides. Knight of Pentacles and Six of Wands. What is this coming for Pisces? And one for the lovers. Two cards. So Pisces, a lot of you might just be wanting to put this to rest altogether and just start something new and focus on you. Definitely, this is a time to focus on yourself. Um, but just know that all this is happening in the background. <laughs> okay. So, yes, whether you know it or not, Pisces, what is out of our awareness is that there's an offer coming. And, you know, I think that this external person that's bringing this offer to you it, you know, has a lot of mental conflict, for sure. Um, you know, there's competition, there's rivalry, whatever that means in your situation. Um, and they want to come bring you, um, you know, they want to have a victory with you, okay, Pisces? Um, and, and, and you're um, kind of scoping out the situation. And the reason why it's not coming together um, is because there's some lack of clarity now, possibly on this external person then. And, um, you know... Pisces, it, it's not all one-sided. Sometimes, um, or really all of the time, when there's something in our external, we really have to um, sit back and look within ourselves. Again, this, 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 major, this major topic of, of working on ourselves during this time, okay? When we're having feelings of despair or you know, thinking it's not happening, it's not happening fast enough, it's not happening fast enough, we're putting that energy out, so really, you know, we're sitting here days feeling like that, when in reality, if we were to turn the situation around, and work on ourselves, and really work on that emotion, and try to smooth that out, and analyze why we feel that way, then we would speed the process up, because our energy is shifting, which is shifting this other person's energy, okay, it's, when, when you're soulmates, you mirror yourself, okay, you work on yourself, and you heal yourself, you heal the people around you, okay, what, what was it, there was a Hawaiian, uh, I believe a psychologist, or just a doctor, um, that believes every person we encounter in our life, every single person, they are in our life for a reason, and if you heal yourself, you will heal a part in them. Um, you know, that's the reason why they are in your life. I believe that he, um, that doctor worked um, in, in, in Hawaii for a mental institute. And um, he wrote a book. He did a thing, you know, as he, he didn't even see the patients, okay? He looked at their files. And as he looked at their files, he, he wondered, what is it about? Why did the universe put me here in encounter with this person? There's something that needs to be healed. So he looked at their file he, he, he analyzed what about that person, you know, struck a chord with him and then what he needed to heal, which would heal that person. And he would go, uh, I love you. Uh, I forgive you. Thank you. I'm sorry. Or, you know, and, and I think it's in a different order. I'm sorry. I forgive you. Uh, thank you. I love you. Um, and after it turned out that that mental institute had to close because he healed everyone, um, you know, really... So this is an energy thing, and, and really the major thing that I jumped on here for is, um, you know, th this time is very important for Pisces. A lot of things are coming up for us, and, and more so I feel resentment towards this person that's just taking forever, and, and, it, and it's really because they, they have no idea how to come forward, um, and it's like... 
yes, people have to take accountability. I'm not saying forgive or, you know, Pisces, we can be overly compassionate. We, ha we have to hold people accountable. Um, but you know when it's coming from a place of accountability and when it's coming from a place of fear, hurt, and we really have to try to smooth those things out within ourselves, okay? So any last messages for Pisces? Move forward, okay? So move forward from any feelings um, of that are not serving you. Let's see. Move forward from what exactly? Spirit angels and guides. What does Pisces need to move forward from? To wrap this reading up. What does Pisces need to move forward from? What does Pisces need to move forward from? What does Pisces need to move forward from? I just saw the tower. Didn't see if it was up. What does Pisces need to move forward from? What does Pisces need to move forward from, Spirit Angels and Guides? Page of Swords reverse from deception, manipulation, you know, people that are all talk. Maybe some energies like that within yourself. Maybe deceiving yourself. What else? And you need to move forward with joy and determination. So yes, Pisces. I feel like it's not finished here. I want to know if you move forward with joy and determination with this person. Or if you move forward with joy and determination by yourself. Because I feel, Pisces, that there is a situation in the past, okay? There's a situation in the past that, you know, you're, uh, that's what's possibly coming forward. Yeah, so um, there's a situation in the past that's coming forward that you could possibly entertain. It's like there could be victory here, yet a lot has happened in the past, and yet what it's telling you here, Pisces, is to really move away from um, any immaturity, okay, any feelings of, um, you know, disappointment. I, I, I really feel that it's more than anything, this person is not ready. This is a time for you to focus on yourself. Again, move away from... Um, any of those feelings within yourself, okay? Take a look in your um, your unconscious mind, okay? And use your intuition to really look inside of you and um, pinpoint all those, um, all those disappointments. Why do you feel that way? Any insecurity? Um, and it's telling you to move forward with joy and determination, okay? If you do this, you will... Um, move forward with that during determination and, and and you know what i think pisces is obviously water signs are really good at taking that hurt that pain and really transmuting that energy and making it into something beautiful you know really growing from it not everybody grows from their pain a lot of people stay stuck in it and for years and years and years and years you know obviously we're becoming more enlightened and um you know there's a shift happening and there's a conscious a consciousness shift in this world and that's exactly what's happening where we are learning um how to work with our minds we are understanding our emotional states better and, and and how to heal our minds and our emotions in order not to, to maintain stuck in situations for as long i think you know a, a point is to to learn how to move uh you know from from loss faster okay transition faster from loss you know that 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 really is, is is where it's at you can't stay stuck in that energy and i think pisces is really um you know with that self-love um you know they're really mastering that self-love thing okay so guys i hope this was insightful i i really just felt the intuitive hunch to come on here and, and share a few things um let me know if that resonated at all um comments what do you guys think yeah i, I want to know what you guys are feeling um as well so yeah, I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.